Good evening. We're going to get started this afternoon, and uh, I want to welcome you uh, and introduce our, uh, our, our star tonight, our local uh, talent. Anna Henderson is an exceptionally gifted person. She started playing piano at age seven and soon after also began the creative journey of writing her own original songs, many of which are featured on her YouTube channel, including her all-new CD, which she's debuting tonight. A lover of music, especially from the 30s and 40s era, she's inspired in her daily life to share the gifts the Lord has given her. She has a heart for the elderly, connecting with them over their shared love of music from past generations. Along with being a loving daughter, sister, and aunt, her life is filled with faithful service, such as serving as church pianist, blessing people by performing at local nursing homes and writing books, of which she has published many, including a detective series. Her written works are available uh, on her website, that's Anna. Dot com. As her pastor, I can testify as to her faithfulness and character. Anna is a godly woman, kind, gentle, patient, caring, compassionate, God-fearing, and humble. Godly women love God. They seek Him, and they, they continue serving Him even on their darkest days. What defines a godly lady? What makes a lady a lady? It's not who she's married to or if she's married or unmarried. It's not how faithful her family is or isn't. It is truly about what is in her heart. It's about how strong her faith is. These are factors that honestly define a lady because they represent her heart and soul before the Lord. Anna Henderson is a loving Christian, faithful servant, gifted musician, and godly lady. She is a lady who dearly loves the Lord and all people, which is evident in everything she does. She embodies the verse that says, Whatsoever thy hand findeth to do, do it with thy might. Now, if you will kindly silence your cell phones and enjoy the evening. Miss Anna Henderson.
So this is a, a portion of, of the evening where, uh, entitled Name That Tune, uh, the uh, music, of course, is from the 30s and 40s. And so what, uh, what we're going to ask, and where is, uh, okay, uh, uh, so what we're going to ask is that if you can name that tune, that you write it down on, on your program, and the first person that uh, lifts the program with the correct answer will win a, a gift for the evening, a free CD. Uh, so get your pens ready. And remember, it is, it is I, I, want it, I want you to have your minds right, so it's not a church hymn. It's a, it's a tune from the 30s and 40s. And uh, there again, you write, the, write on the program, and as you lit, if you lift it up, the first one will win a free CD for the evening. All right? Name that tune. people that uh, uh, were correct, but the first that uh, raised their program tonight with the correct answer was Miss Joyce Lankford. So please give Miss Joyce a hand. She's the winner. And, uh, and so it just goes to show that Miss Joyce was much more cultured than me, than I, okay? So uh, that was wonderful. So, uh, and I know it was arranged by Cole Sandberg, but what was the name of the song? Begin the Begin. Begin the begin. So that was it, all right? Uh, please give Miss Anna a hand once more, and we'll continue our program.
Beautiful. Once again, it is time to play Name That Tune. Makes me feel like I'm an announcer on NPR, <laughs> the symphony hour. Name That Tune. Again, the first person to write it down uh, with a correct answer, just raise your program up and we'll try to get to you. had a couple of guesses, but no one uh, was able to uh, correctly name that tune. Uh, it uh, was ebb and flow, ebb tide. So, so I didn't even get it. How about that? Uh, but that was beautifully done. If we listened to more music like this, we would be healthier people. Really, what it does for your spirit. Uh, thank you. All right, let's continue.
wonderful. This is your final opportunity to name that tune. But before we begin, I'm curious, this is my own curiosity, uh, was the uh, uh, Sayonara, was that from the uh, King and I? No, it was from a Marlon Brando movie. Oh, a Marlon Brando. <laughs> well, I will have just as likely watched uh, the Marlon Brando movie as a Yul Brenner movie, so uh, wonderful. That was wonderful. All right, so now it's time. Again, the final opportunity for Name That Tune. We had a winner on uh, that number. The title of the song was Dream, and uh, Miss Sue Knight won the uh, CD tonight. So give her a hand. All right. That's wonderful. Okay, so uh, we're going to uh, listen to the, uh, the next song, and then I would like to uh, introduce the last three.
Incredible. Haven't you enjoyed tonight? Yeah. Give her a hand, please. Several months ago, uh, we were planning the first revival for Amazing Grace in her history. And uh, speaking with uh, each of our deacons, uh, they all had wonderful ideas on how we should brand and advertise uh, our church to the community. And Richard Hammond, uh, the chairman of our deacon board, he, he uh, said something that I will never forget. He said, uh, forget about the preaching. Let's just let people know we have the best pianist in the state. <laughs> yeah. I said, I, I agree. There's many, many, many Sundays where, uh, where I feel like um, uh, that, that maybe, the, maybe I, the, the preaching should be before the uh, instrumental. And so, uh, but it, it's wonderful, and I've had a wonderful time tonight. And I appreciate all of the, uh, the, the many, many, many hours that, and throughout her lifetime that she has uh, learned and mastered this gift. And it is from the Lord, right? Let's give the Lord a hand. The very next uh, uh, numbers are Autumn Wind, Sun in My Eyes, and Anna's Serenade. All three of the final numbers were written and recorded by Miss Anna Henderson and can be found on her CD. I encourage you to purchase her CD before you leave. Purchase this for you and for your soul. Music, music is uh, something that will affect your soul either in a positive way or a negative way. I I can, uh, I can give you the, the uh, doctor's note on this. This will affect your soul in a positive way. Uh, and I'm sure you, you already know that from, from tonight. So purchase the CD and enjoy the rest of the program.
Ray Charles, eat your heart out. <laughs> Thank you for that encore. Miss Anna Henderson. Thank you so much for uh, joining us tonight uh, for this evening of beautiful music. And uh, again, I encourage you to stop by the table and purchase a CD for, uh, for your home and uh, just think how much uh, uh, house work you could get done when you're happy and enjoying yourself. Uh, ladies, your husbands may even help. Uh, so anyway, thank you again for being here, and uh, this was a prelude to Sunday, so be sure to be here Sunday, where you will again hear the talented and gifted Miss Anna Henderson. Once more, give her a hand, and you are dismissed.